do I need to sleep? It will take a minute. This is the ultimate birthday meal. So I'm 42 now, and this is what I wanted. This is from our, uh, this is, what kind of food do you call this? I'm not sure, like Mediterranean. It's Jerusalem shawarma. Like they have like the best food ever. It's so good. We always get like their, what is it, their donairs? We get donairs yeah. there and the shawarmas and yeah, it's like stuff so like good. that. It's different, like there's, the, you know, like the Canadian style donair. We go to Uncle Mo's for that. Like those, they have the best, those tradition, like those type of donairs. And this is more like this, like Medi yeah, whatever you call this Middle type. Eastern, yeah, Eastern, I guess. Yeah, but it's so good. Like yeah. their food is. So this is what I wanted for. This is actually this is the family platter. family platter for five meat lovers, and then we have three pies, cherry, apple crumble in the middle, apple and crumble, apple caramel. And those are from a Demille's in Sam Arm, BC. Like our favorite. Oh, thank you. Our favorite uh, place to get pies when we go on vacation. And this is what Devin wanted to do. I'm not by any means gonna eat like a ton of food. I'm gonna eat as much as you want. I'm just gonna eat, help eat. him eat it <laughs> until I'm full, basically. I'll post the calories there. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go. All right. Do you want to put the sauce on? Pour it on, or do you? Oh, no, I was just gonna put it on my. Well, this plate. is the. Well, it'll be easier just to pour. A little, this is tahini. We like tahini. You just put a little bit of tahini on there. It'll be easier to put it on. And you can mix it in then. What is this? this those are the beef kebabs. We got beef kebabs. Beef kebab. I don't know. One of those we got ones. chicken kebabs and then some beef shawarma Maybe meat, chicken shawarma meat, meat, rice, yeah. garlic potatoes, hummus, yeah. and some salad. I'm going to be civilized and eat off of a plate. Mm. <laughs> All right. <laughs> you got some hummus? Mm. Mm-hmm. Oh, this is the garlic. Oh garlic boy. sauce. Oh boy. It should smell pretty now. Mm hmm Mmm. So good though. Mm-hmm. There's salad in here too. Mmm. <laughs> that garlic sauce is insane. Mm-hmm. talk about so a lot of people ask how we like this and stay relatively fit first of all we don't do this all the time um, you know every once in a while it's not the end of the world you know sometimes you know you have to live life too and sometimes it's about moments instead of macros uh, but most of the time what we do is called flexible dieting or IFYM um, so basically we eat the foods we like um, just within certain macros which is your protein carbs and fats um, and yeah, yeah and it, that's what works for us. Mm -hmm. Um, you know, we don't just eat what people call junk food. I, you know, personally, I don't like that term. Like you shouldn't be, I don't believe you should label food as good or bad. It's just food and you know, it shouldn't have power. Right. So it's just food. Right. And yes, we do eat a lot of whole foods, natural foods is too. Um, but then we fit in the other foods that we like as well. And it mm -hmm. just, you know, as long as you do that, you can, you know, certain uh, one specific food is not going to hinder your progress in any which way, right? So if you have, you know, for example, I like Doritos. I eat Doritos a lot, but I weigh them out and I fit them into my macros for the day. I don't just eat a whole bag, for example, every night, right? Mm -hmm. So that's the difference. So anyway, bon appetit. Mm -hmm. And then for because I knew I would be eating a lot for dinner. Um, I had breakfast today. I did cardio this morning and I lifted weights before 
this afternoon, like before my clients that I trained. And then I had a protein bar after I worked out and then that's all I've eaten all day. So I'm hungry. <laughs> Because I knew we were going to eat a lot tonight, so I, that's what I did. So I had a good breakfast, and then I had a little something after I worked out to tie me over. And I kept myself busy by going getting my hair done. Because, no, my hair does not always look like this. It's all curly and done. It's been a really long time since I had my, oh my god. I, like, seven weeks since I had my hair cut, which is really long for me because it's short. So it was really nice to get my hair done today. Thank you to my wonderful stylist, Carrie. If she's watching this, hi. Make sure it's the green light on. It's red light. On the microphone. Okay, good. <laughs> Double check and we got sound because we <laughs> yeah. had some issues before where we uh, forgot to We did a whole entire microphone. video on vacation with no sound. Mm -hmm. That's why we had to dub over our zombie burger video. Yeah. That was a bummer. People don't like long videos, so we have to eat fast. I don't, well, no, you just <laughs> speed it up. I'm not gonna eat fast, Devin. I have leg day tomorrow, so this will be good fuel for leg day. Mm hmm. What other stories do you have? Any other words of a wisdom? Not really. <laughs> we have two kids. Yep. Both work. Yep. We just make time. I go I work I go to the gym five days a week. I go at least five, but I work in the gym, so. But even before you did. No, even before I did. Still worked out five days a week. Just made it a priority. Just like you brush your teeth every day. I go to the gym. There's always time. I have two kids. Our oldest son has Down syndrome. It requires special attention. And I make it work. It's important to me. I guess if it's important to you, then you make it work. Mm-hmm. What are you doing? Mm. Hmm. Um. The fork fell in. Mm-hmm. Garlic sauce. And pita. Oh <laughs> <laughs> Next weekend, I'm looking forward to skiing mm. at church. I have to get my cowboy boots out. Mm -hmm. The electric says health, health and fitness. <laughs> Zero calorie, mm -hmm. want to add extra. We already have enough. <laughs> we have health in there a whole entire top salad. We could have picked many other salads, but mm -hmm. we figured why add more calories when we really don't need to. And it's actually quite good. Mm -hmm. They do have the crispy pitas in it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. They do. We have some pie and then go back to this. Mix it up. <laughs> <clears throat> I 
You're eating large amounts of food, apparently, if you mix the sweet and savory, it's easier. Mm -hmm. I can't believe the amount of rice they put in here. Well, it's ridiculous. It's cheap, so. That's no, true. It's, really it's a good filler. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I wonder what they mix it with. Mm. It tastes really good. You're full? Well, yeah, I want to eat some of the pie, so I need to stop. Mm. <laughs> I don't eat nearly as much. Mm. Open some pies and then come back. If you want. It's up to you. You're already breathing heavy. A little bit. <laughs> You've got rice on your shirt. Okay. So, made pretty good dent, actually. <laughs> There's quite a bit of food in there. Supposed to be for a lot of rice, yeah. Yeah, it was a lot of rice. Like, a lot of rice. <sighs> um. Excuse me. And they have some baklava, too. Oh, mm. the baklava is so good. Their baklava is so good. Get your plate closer. There you go. You're gonna eat all that. <laughs> don't, don't let the crumbs let fall. Let's see how this one is. How this one fares up to the caramel apple, which is our favorite. Mmm. Pretty good too. Mm -hmm. Similar to the caramel apple, just crispy mm -hmm. instead of that caramel on top. Yeah. Mm. Their pies are so good. Mm -hmm. oh They're from DeMille's in BC. Yeah, and Salmon Arm. They have, I don't know, the crust, that's... It's gotta be the crust. The crust is just like, mm -hmm. yeah, I don't know, they're really good anyway. Mm -hmm. Like, usually when I would eat a pie, I would never eat the crust. Like, you know, you leave that crust that goes over the pie plate. But it's seriously so good. I eat the whole thing. Mm-hmm. I'm 42, like I said, it was my birthday, she's 48. I'm 48. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I only feel 48 sometimes. <laughs> mm -hmm. Like when I get up in the morning, my lower back and all my joints are stiff and aching. Until I start moving around. But that could just be from, you know, working out so much, as so much as I do. And my body is always much harder on my body for prep, too. It's crazy. Because now I've been lifting longer. And like pushing like almost eight years, my volume has to like go up too so that I can see changes. So my volume this prep was like five sets of everything and it was exhausting. So I've scaled it way down right now <laughs> just to kind of give my body a break. I don't want cherry. Hmm? I don't want that one. <laughs> Three quarters of a pie I just ate. You didn't eat all of it. Okay, well, I left some crust. There's still some crust. I would 
Gotta save a little room. Come on. A tree here would eat the whole entire thing. I know. Well, I'm not. Okay, this is mine. Okay. But you can leave some in this plate because I'll have, I have oh, okay, another fine. piece later. Or tomorrow or something. I won't eat the whole one this time. I People are going to be disappointed. <laughs> I think they'll live. People are like, what? He couldn't even eat the pie. This one's harder to cut because of the caramel in it. Fine, I'll just have like this, this path here. Yeah, piece. sure. It's not even cut yet. Okay, there we go. Yeah, it'll be. Because after this, I'm tapping out. We still got cherry pie. I'm tapping it. I'll take a bite of it just to try it, but this is the caramel apple. Look at this. It's so gorgeous. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Seriously, this pie is the best. I love mm -hmm. this one. And we're weird. We like to eat our pie cold. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm. Mm-hmm. Holy Toledo. Are you getting full? Mm-hmm. Oh. But this was the appetizer. <laughs> I don't think so. Um I purposely didn't eat hardly anything today really. Cherry. <laughs> what? Well, let's cut that one in half too. I also have the same size as you on that one. I'm just gonna. Have, I was just gonna have a bite. Oh, okay. Well, cut cut the same size as the one you cut for yourself there, and have a bite of that, and I'll have the rest. I thought I could eat more again. Mm, no. This is filling. Like this is. It a is lot. pretty filling. Yeah. Did you have a fork? Oh, okay. That is like. Excuse me. Okay, I'm just gonna take a bite because I'm full. <laughs> How's the cherry? Sour cherry. Mm mm. Mm. Really good. You like that? Mm hmm. It's like cherry, cherry. Like real cherries. Yep. Mmm. Mm hmm. You can tell. Cherries and apples are my favorite fruit. You can tell the difference between like a pie filling and then that. Like, and real fruit. Yeah. Mm hmm. It's so good. Buckle up. Good lord, no, not right now. <laughs> I'll eat it at another time because I love that baklava. It's so good. <sighs> Does Zachary like that baklava? I can't remember. Mm hmm. Mm. Okay, back to the shawarmas. I'm gonna finish all of that, including the rice. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> all right. I guess we can't be competitive food eaters. God no. But this is just a typical like we planned this, so yeah, this is usually more than I would normally eat, isn't it? I don't know. A little bit. I think so. The pie, we wouldn't have that much pie. No, we wouldn't have had that much pie. There's no way. Yeah. We're lightweights. Yeah. Well. That's okay. This pie will get eaten. It's delicious. I still ate. Yeah, you still ate one. I ate three quarters of this that. pie yeah. and plus a quarter of this pie. pie. So all together, I ate over one pie. Pie. Plus all. Yeah, you ate quite a bit out of the family tray. Yes. <laughs> I can usually eat between three to four pounds of food. Because I do that a lot too with just high volume, like not a ton of calories, but like egg creations, spinach, frozen vegetables, and some deli ham, and mm -hmm. tomato. 
put it all in a big pot. Weighs about three pounds. <laughs> Crazy. He does that so he won't overeat at night. Pretty much. And just because I like to, I got trained. I'm in training. <laughs> you gotta eat that hot ramen soup when in October. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> what is the other one you want to do? When is that one? The taco one. Oh, the taco one's October 20th. October 20th? Guardian. So that's after the ramen. Well, I don't want the ramen. Oh, she just said in October. In October. She when. Yes, yeah, so I have to go back because I qualified for the finales. Yeah. Devin's gonna do, what is it, the, a taco contest one? Eat as many tacos as you can in 20 minutes. Oh, okay. So eat as many tacos as you can in 20 minutes. And the, it's $100 to... It's for charity. Them, but it's for charity. It's for the... To, Children's, Children's Hospital, Hospital. Which we have frequented a lot. A lot. <laughs> Family Child with Down Jackson Syndrome. Jackson goes there for his... He had his hip surgery there. He goes to the dentist there. Eyes. His eyes are there. Everything. All and his doctors the, are there. And the E one called? Endocrine. Endocrine there, yeah. yeah. He had a and hernia when he was yeah. a younger. And his orthopedic surgeon, which we have to do that again soon mm -hmm. in March. We have to see Dr. Dawkin again. Yep. And he'll have to have the pin and the two screws taken out of his hip this year. And when he was when he was younger, they used to have the Down Syndrome, syndrome Clinic. Clinic thing, is that what it's called? Yeah, but because of funding... It's no longer there, which is really a shame because that clinic helped Devin and I tremendously until Jackson was five years old. That's what they usually, that's what they did. It was from the time they were born until they were five years old. You were part of that clinic and they helped you with everything. They had, yeah, they had a physiotherapist. This, they had a nutritionist. They had occupational help, therapy. They had everything. Mm -hmm. Swimming, they did swimming with the kids. They did all kinds of things. And it's a shame that it's gone because I can't imagine... Really well, there's still sense. other programs in Calgary, Yeah, too. there's other programs, we have but ups that and was downs. really good in the we beginning. Ups and downs and prep as well. Yeah, which Jackson still goes to. He goes to prep for his speech. So. Mm -hmm. And I have him in music therapy for his speech because he really likes music. Maybe he'll turn into a Cody Lee. Mm. <laughs> you never know. <laughs> if we wait a couple more minutes, I could probably eat another pie. Oh, God. All right, no. I guess. That's what are you gonna do? Our big eating birthday eating. Yeah, we're kind of lightweights, I guess. Oh. I guess we'll have to stick to reviews. <laughs> Nothing exciting here. Mm.